Want to have quicker access to your cash when you're making sales on Shopify? Then this video is for you. What's up Hair Business Blueprint? It's your hair business's best friend, Mikey. Today we're gonna go over all the pros and cons of the new Shopify feature called Shopify Balance. Now this will help give you facts, faster access to your capital once you're making sales. It also kind of acts like a bank. It does have some rewards and really good features. Now I don't love everything about it, but there are definitely some good things that you need to know that you can use for your business so let's take a look but first if you're wondering you're like gosh mikey where are you that place is so beautiful i'm actually in the new private label store that's going to be opening soon here in tucker georgia it is my dedication to our amazing clients i wanted to make the most beautiful place for you to come visit. Uh, I will have a video coming soon on how much it costs to open a store like this. And uh, eventually we're gonna be looking for partners like you. So I need you to level up your game because we're only partnering with the best. All right, so we're gonna go over Shopify balance from a business owner's perspective, pros, cons, a little marketing behind some of what they put out there. So let's just go through it. So as I mentioned, you know, this is a quick, easy way to get access to your, uh, your capital once you make sales. So it says here, skip the bank. This is true. Like I said, this is very much like a PayPal account. So when you sell on PayPal, you have instant access to the funds. Same kind of thing. Once you have a Shopify store, it's really easy to get this set up. You're just going to click log in to set up Shopify balance. You're going to go through a few steps and you're good to go. Uh, so let's go through what they say is great about Shopify balance. I'm going to give you pros and cons to some of this. Okay, so the money management account built for business like yours. So save money, no hidden fees. Okay, so that's good. You're, when it says no hidden fees, they maybe are referring it compared to a credit card where you might have an annual fee. Uh, but most of the time when you're spending money, you shouldn't have any fees anyway. So, you know, just to think about that. Uh, bring everything to, uh, together. No need to open a business bank account. Manage your money where you run your business. I think that's a bad idea. You always want a business bank account, guys. Like that's free to set up. That's super easy. Get. Uh, I generally recommend like either a local bank that you really like, or if you travel a lot, you definitely want a national bank because when I travel, I mean we have accounts at Chase, Truist. Wells Fargo, and that's important to me because when I travel, if I have an issue and I need to go into a bank, it's great if I'm in a different city and I can walk in a branch and deal with whatever I have to deal with. Um, so having just relying on Shopify for your bank is very dangerous. I wouldn't do that. You don't technically probably need to open a business bank account if you want to do this, but have both. It makes sense. Uh, so Shopify bounce rewards later in the video, we're going to get into this and kind of pros and cons of what I see from this relative to a credit card, uh, uh, a rewards credit card, which is really important for your business. Uh, earn 2% cash back when you spend on marketing, shipping and growing your uh, business with Shopify. Now it doesn't look like that's all marketing. So we'll get back to that. Uh, earn 10% cash back when you hire Shopify experts to help build or level up your store. Now that's kind of cool to get a little discount, but how often are you really hiring someone, you know, an expert to work on your Shopify store? And that's through Shopify's expert, uh, expert program. You know, if you think back and if it's something you're doing all the time, cause you're really customizing your store, this might be beneficial. If not, then, it's kind of not really a reward for you. Uh, unlock exclusive offers and discounts. Now, I'm telling you, they might have some offers and discounts, but exclusive, you probably can get this about anywhere. Uh, so don't go too high on that. The rewards are okay, but I think with credit cards, you can get better rewards. But maybe you can't get a credit card right now. If you were like me when I first started my business and my credit was in shambles, Something like this is good because at least you're getting something. But we're gonna get to rewards later in the video. Get paid faster. Now, like I said, this is key. This is this is the reason you know a lot of people will need this. 
Now, with Dropship Bundles and Dropship Beauty, we've been working with clients since 2016 doing dropshipping. So we're in year six of dropshipping. I mean, we have thousands of dropship clients at this point. And one of the issues they always have is they get a sale. They might not have the funds saved to pay for the hair when you're dropshipping right? Or that could be for any business. If you're watching this and you don't drop ship hair or wigs, you know, expensive products, but you just don't have the funds readily available to pay for that order to get it shipped. That's where Shopify Balance really shines and it can help a lot of people that haven't really established their business yet and doesn't have that savings as of yet. So getting paid faster, this is absolutely key. So as the sales come in, you can use your Shopify balance card, which it's a pretty sick looking card. I got to give them that. Okay. It's very Apple-esque. Um, so, you know, having access to that now it says four days faster. I can tell you, I think, uh, with our private label sales, they come in next day or 48 hours, but you know, with drop shipping, the key is this, you need to get that order paid for so it can be fulfilled as fast as possible. So it can be shipped to your customer. So this is really important that you have that access. This is definitely the number one feature for Shopify Balance. And if what I'm saying makes sense to you, sign up for this. This is free, guys. It's worth it. Okay, so manage your money where you make it with Shopify Balance. So, okay, we're going to go over this. This does make some sense. Uh, manage your money and business in one place. No monthly fees, account fees, or transfer fees. Yeah, that's okay. I mean, you can get out of that with most banks. Sign up online in minutes to avoid the paperwork. Don't be afraid of paperwork, guys. Like, just because it's easy doesn't always mean it's better, but it is convenient. They they can do this because they already have most of your information when you sign up with Shopify. You're processing credit card payments with Shopify, so they have all your information. They know who you are. It's just they don't need it again, basically. Uh, get paid the next business day. No minimum account balance required, so that could be really helpful. Earn up to $2,000 cash back per year. We talked about that. Um, well, we're going to talk about that in the uh, upcoming rewards and earnings section for that. FDIC eligible up to 250 grand. Most people aren't going to have 250 grand in their bank anyway. Um, so that's, you know, it's fine. So that matches here. Limited or no rewards program, you know, for banks. If, you're, if you have a bank account, you shouldn't be using your debit card or a bank credit card unless it's a rewards card. So this is true, but this is not the best way to go about it. I'm going to be talking a lot more about credit card rewards and how it can change your life as a business owner in upcoming videos. That's a good segue to say, make sure you subscribe to the Hair Business Blueprint. Uh, up to $5,000 minimum account balance required. You know, that's def yeah, up to is fine, but there's definitely banks that'll work with you. Uh, get paid up to four days later. If you're processing payments, you're probably not processing payments with your traditional bank anyway. Uh, in-person application, weeks for approval. Uh, usually it's in-person application. You will get your bank account the same day. I don't know where they're coming up with. It takes weeks to get approved for a bank account. Uh, $10 monthly fees or more, for sure. That is that is possible if you have a low account, uh, low balance in your account. Manage your money and business in multiple places. Uh, you can do that online. So that's, you know, not too big right there. So the merchants, you know, obviously they're going to have fantastic uh, reviews from owners. Uh, let's see. So how is Shopify different from balance different from a traditional bank? Uh, all in one money management, you know, business in one place, get paid faster and bank void fees. No hidden fees. OK, cool. That's amazing. Uh, doesn't charge ATM withdrawal fees, but remember the with the ATM is probably going to charge you fees, but most people aren't taking cash. Like you really probably aren't taking cash out of an ATM for your business, or you definitely shouldn't. I don't think in I've ever taken cash out of our business bank account. I mean, I don't even have debit cards for our business bank accounts to make it harder to get money out, but that's a whole nother story. Uh, I'm just starting my store. Can I use Shopify Balance? Yes. So they make it, you know, really easy for you to get started. So you gotta, you gotta give it up to Shopify for making it easier for you to get started. Where can I use my Shopify Balance card? So this is basically like a Visa. So that works out really well. Visa is accepted everywhere. Uh, easier, faster, more rewarding. Uh, like I said, slick card. You know, probably be showing off a little bit using that. Pretty cool. Uh, I think their online system makes it really easy to be able to manage all, all your expenditures. 
Uh, same thing. So let's go over more to this is the feature section. Uh, set up your business account online in minutes. So they already basically have all your information once again. Get paid faster so you can get paid uh, the next business day or probably even the same business day depending on your account. That's going to help people a lot. Uh, earn cash back with rewards. We're going to go over skip the bank. Uh, let's see here. So access your money when you need it. So business spending card. So it's a virtual card or a physical card. You definitely want a physical card as well. Uh, you can add it to your Apple Pay or Google Wallet. So that's super easy. Contactless payments. Super easy. Uh, it's pretty similar to like a credit card. But like I said, it's just a different option. Manage everything in one place. Pay out the next business day. I think they're trying to do this where you get the same day like uh, PayPal. Um, but And I think some accounts maybe have it. I'm not sure yet, uh, but definitely that's the way they're going. Uh, finances in order. So obviously this is something we always talk about is keeping your business finances separate from your personal finances. That's absolutely key. Easy money transfer. So it's easy to pay for stuff. That's pretty much anything. Simple tax filing. Uh, so they probably have reports to make it easier for that. Rewards, I'm going to skip that because we're going to go to the rewards section. Uh, always in control. So being able to lock your car, this is an important feature. Just in case you lose it, you need to be able to go online and lock it. I can't stand when banks, pretty much all banks now have this, but it's annoying if they don't. Uh, so FDIC insured, dedicated support team. Shopify does have really good support. So that's something to expect with Shopify balance. Uh, better than some banks, to be honest. And then let's get into the rewards. This is kind of like the sweet spot for me because I'm all about rewards. Everything we spend in the private label organization, drop shipping, drop ship beauty, everything. Uh, we use real credit cards, Amex, Visa. I have different ones for different reasons. And they all re uh, earn rewards points. I use it mostly for travel so and status. So using that, I'm going to make some videos on you know, kind of how to hack the system and such. That's going to be really important. So 2% cash back on business essentials. So advertise on Google, Snapchat, Instagram, Pinterest, and TikTok. Premium themes. So you're probably only going to buy a theme. You know, the themes, I think right now, the Shopify 2.0 are about $250. 2% uh, back on that is only going to save you about 5 bucks, And you're not going to be buying themes. You're probably going to buy a theme once every few years, maybe change that theme. Uh, so, you know, you can look at that at 5 bucks. Shopify apps, you know, we do spend some money on apps, so that could help. Custom domains. I usually like to register my domains with GoDaddy, so that's not going to help me much. Uh, Shopify email. If you're using Shopify email, which is a good starter email system, uh, getting 2% back on that, it can help. And Shopify shipping. Now, the difference between this and a traditional credit card that earns rewards points, it's not just these categories. These are usually bonuses. So what you can do is get 1% on basically everything and up to say two, three, four, five percent uh, bonus on these kind of items. And these are usually things you choose through Amex or Visa. There's different uh, types of credit cards out there. So this does look good, but me personally, I'd rather have points on everything because we spend money on more than just this. This is this is good, but this is a good start. And this is something new Shopify offers. So I am expecting for their uh, rewards to continue to grow. Obviously, they're going to put push their Shopify experts. And that links over to the Shopify experts marketplace. Uh, you know, money to back in reinvest back in your business. You know, there you can you can get if you really want that, you can also get a credit card that does cash back on all purchases. But like I said, I do understand if your credit's not there yet, you know, really for these good business rewards cards, I would say minimum probably six, uh, 680 for some of the lower tier business rewards cards. 700, you're looking really good. Guys, you should always be working on your credit, checking it, figuring out how to dispute things to get things off there, being on time with your payments. I always say, if you can't pay it off today, you shouldn't be putting on it on your credit card unless it's an emergency. So, you know, remember that. 
No points to redeem, just real money to earn. Yeah, that's kind of cool, but honestly, redeeming the points and having them stacked up for certain things is kind of fun. Uh, so this might be, if, you don't, if you're not really into the rewards game like myself, uh, this might be a great solution for you. So this is all about what works best for you. Uh, exclusive offers, which we mentioned, so save 30% on workspace, professional email, video meetings, some more. Okay, so Google Workspace now, the price keeps going up, guys. When I started making these videos, they were like $5, then it went to 10. I think I just paid for the new business we started, like $18. That's a lot, so 30% back on that is gonna save you three, two, five, $5.40. You know, Google Workspace is basically professional email, video meetings, and more. So that'll probably save you about five bucks a month. 10% uh, cash back when you start a Snapchat campaign. I don't know if that's, if you start a Snapchat campaign, I don't know if that's ongoing. So that's something you definitely want to look at. Start spending on Google ads and receive $500 credit when you spend the first 500. Now that's, that's pretty sweet. Like honestly, it might be worth it to get this card if you're going to spend money on Google just to get this $500 credit. Uh, that's that's a pretty good deal. So this is like instant $500 free in Google Ads. Uh, get $100 in Snapchat ads credits for new advertisers when you spend 25. Now that's key is new advertisers. So if you've already been advertising on Snapchat, you're probably not going to qualify for this. Uh, but that's okay. I don't really know as many people advertising on Snapchat opposed to Facebook and Instagram. So it could be worth it. Uh, spend $25, get $100 Snapchat ad credit. So this together, if you're new business especially, this is $600 in free advertising from this card. Yeah, this is definitely worth it. Uh, get up to $150 in Pinterest ad credits for new advertisers with no minimum spend. That's pretty sweet. So now we're at $500, $600, $750 in free advertising. All right, the card's looking better to me. Uh, even if you get this card, which now I'm looking at this, I need to definitely get it. Uh, when you get this card, you can use this up and then start spending money on your regular credit cards. Or if you don't have your regular rewards credit cards, you can keep this going. 3% cash back when you make purchases from apple.com. Now here at Private Label, we are Apple everything. A 3% cash back, that is actually pretty sweet, guys. I mean, this Mac computer I'm recording on is like two grand. Uh, so that would give me $60 cash back. That's pretty cool. Save 15% on printing, packaging supplies, and additional business services. Now this looks good. And remember, this is not 15% on shipping. Printing, I mean, how often are you going into UPS to buy printing? or to print stuff, probably not real often. Packaging supplies, you're probably buying from Uline, who is way better than UPS for that. And additional business services, it's not real clear what that is. So I think overall, and this gives you kind of like some of these offers, really what's going on. Uh, overall, I think this is really good. And let's really talk about it. Okay, so as you can see, Shopify Balance definitely has a lot to offer. I'm a huge fan of credit card rewards points because I can travel all, all over the world for free at this point. That's something I want you to do too, but there's definitely some things that you can get out of Shopify Balance, like some of the extra credits that you can get from Google, the ads, the ad spend. I think they're gonna be adding to this as well, so make sure that you keep updated with that. Uh, is it worth it? Yeah, it only takes a minute to sign up and it's just great to have a little bit quicker access to your cash. But please make sure you still have that business bank account. Once your credit is in good shape, go ahead and get that business credit card that either does cash back or rewards. I'm telling you guys, these are the little perks that have changed my life having a business in beauty. And I want you to have a full understanding of how it can change your life as well. So if you have any questions or comments about Shopify Balance, please let me know in the comments below. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and once again, if you're wondering where I am, this is actually the new VIP room at the Private Label Tucker. Not everybody's gonna have access to this, I'm sorry. Maybe I can give access to one of my amazing subscribers that leaves a comment right now about how they're growing their hair business. That would be great. Anyways, I'll be back with another video probably tomorrow, so stay tuned and make sure you're subscribed to the Hair Business Blueprint.